Hello, Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes uh, players. This is Andy Teshorto. And today, yeah, I, I have to admit, I haven't been up, keeping update with all the news and announcements. And that's my bad. I've just had a busy, you know, holiday has been crazy. So I do want to discuss this one here um, about uh, the Dark Side Territory battles, stuff like that. So, yeah, recently we got the update. Um, we got the Dark Side Territory battle. We got Territory Wars getting ready to start in the next, like, five to seven days um but one of the things is dark um so yeah there's been some discussion on the forums about the difficulty of dark side territory battle and the number of territory points in particular we've discovered that players are receiving the incorrect number and after completing missions additionally we are aware that <clears throat> battles are extremely difficult particularly in phase one which yes i've played phase one and oh my goodness that is a pain in the rear to face it's 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 crazy so yeah anyway so uh which is unaffected by platoon missions while it is intended to be difficult there are some number of factors that we may be making that may be making it too hard especially the first few phases however we can make changes only after the territory battle is complete we will be monitoring the end of the battle very closely and will provide additional information uh, next week about the compensating players for any errors we discover as we dig through the results of the first territory battle. So, yes, we'll have to endure. Um, I wanted to get this one out because there's a lot of people talk out there that um, a lot of people are just not, you know, it's just been difficult. And I agree, it has been difficult. Um, you know, I, I can't even finish a couple of the phases like I still need to use bounty hunters and stuff like that I still need to finish my phase three stuff so it's it's been nuts it's been nuts but you know I'm still you know getting as far as my character my characters will allow me um <clears throat> so yeah and, and what's funny is it seems like a lot of people are having it's always that phase four phase four is where or round four whatever it is in the battles that they just can't get you know they can't complete so Obviously, this is a message to say dark side territory battles, the difficulty and points earned. Um, they're going to, you know, work with them after the first territory battle round. Um, but I think the reason why they also made, you know, dark side a little diff more difficult is if you think about it, if you look at the um, the trails, the light side and dark side trail in the game, um, the light side is a lot easier for the most for the most part than the dark side. The dark side's a little harder, but then again, that's also because um, a lot of the hard hitter characters are light side versus dark side. They're more, you know, they do random tricks and stuff. Like you got Nihilus, you got Mother Tals, and you know, they don't, they, there's still some that do heavy damage. Like droids are the ones that do heavy damage. But even then, like when I was using droids on one of the, uh, battles, um, cause the droids I have to use is HK 88, 86, B2, and, um, <clears throat> General Grievous and General Grievous, of course, still needs a rework, but um, for the most part, um, he just doesn't dish as much damage out. Um, I don't really have anyone else to put in that spot, or normally I'd have R2 there, and then I would have probably beaten it. Um, and of course, instead of B2, I would have K2, but my droid team can't work that way on a dark side battle, so I had to, you know, substitute two characters. Uh, B2 is still great, he helped kept the uh positive status effect dispelled that's phenomenal but it, in the end in the end it just wasn't enough i wasn't doing enough damage ig88 and 86 were the easy ones to do a lot of damage but they're also the squishiest and i'm still kind of working on them little bit by little bit so but yeah that is territory battles i'm just gonna <clears throat> kind of go through all these other uh forms so prepare your ships for territory wars so yeah, th this one just kind of goes over some of the Territory War stuff. Um, territory Wars require units to having a power rating of 6,000 or higher. So, for participations, cannot be used for the duration of the event. So, yeah, that kind of bites. You got to make sure you have characters that are, you know, for uh, 6,000 power and up. So, yeah, I have quite a few, though. I have quite a few. But even then, so, um, let's see, grow your galactic M, um, power. So yeah, just focus on growing your galactic power. 
Um, and, and even for, like, territory battles, you know, taking a level 1 to level 50 never hurts. A character from level 1 to level 50, gearing them up as far as they're able to gear up without farming pieces. Um, getting their um, abilities to mark 3 or whatever. You know, that, that, you know, that kind of stuff helps the galactic power for guild um, territory battles so that you can actually, you know help with deploying you get more points for deploying certain characters um I, every now and then i'll do like two or three characters um leveling them up to level 50 and yeah maybe set <clears throat> so yeah this is just talking about that so i mainly i really wanted to talk about the uh well, this is said the event stuff right schedule of events Eleven twenty six is today Oh, this was updated today? Really? Wow. I didn't even know from the 20th updated today. So, yeah, this just kind of talks about the Territory Wars going ahead. So, earn 10 banners or rewards. So, wow. So, you get 600. So, you get, get you can get close to a million credits. That's nice. The rewards your guild can earn scale up according to the number of active participants. So, encourage your guild mates to play. <clears throat> um yeah that's gonna i will admit I, i'm glad that they're only doing territory battle territory war territory you know they're, they're not doing it you know let's do two territory battles and a territory war you know so, uh, no one would have time to do that and i'm glad they're just kind of spacing it out um so yeah they're getting you know event tokens which is great omegas you get zetas the higher up you go First place and then second place. So first place you get um so yeah, these are the rewards. That's not bad for rewards. Second place credits though, you get really you get really, you know, hurt hard. <laughs> so but like first three places you still get some Zetas. And this is great. They're actually starting to add ways to farm Zetas. You know, you get Mark Three mods and then you get Zetas. Um I wouldn't mind adding some, you know, ship. There's some ship uh, ability mats that could still be added in because c capital ships use a quite a bit, at least till they're maxed out, then they don't need them anymore. <laughs> so, but yeah, that's not bad. Um, mod store. Let's see, the name's blocked. I will admit, I wouldn't mind having that extra 490 and then 197 for the double drops. That would have been nice, but <laughs> the other days, so yeah. So yeah, these are the, still, these are the uh, YouTubers that are covering details on it. So yeah, that's, I'm just showing it through, so. But yeah, that's, that's kind of all I wanted to discuss, really. Mainly, it was the uh, difficulty of territory battle. They are going to work on it. Keep that in mind. Um, so yeah, like I said, you can always... You know, look up the news every day. Like right now, as of today, it's at 48,100 um, for the game updates and develop uh, dev announcements. You still, I love the forums. I love the forums. They're really nice. I don't use Reddit or anything like that, or, you know, some people do, but I, I've just been using the forums. So, but yeah, again, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Uh, let me know what you guys think about the, you know, on what and what your hopes and thoughts are for the update for territory battles um which direction they will go but again thanks for watching and have a wonderful day